We are learning more about the AR style rifle used by the shooter in Saturday's attempted assassination. The FBI told CBS News the gun was legally purchased by and registered to the shooter's father. Nine states have bans on assault rifles. Pennsylvania is not one of them. Investigative reporter Liz Crawford began looking into Pennsylvania's gun laws, and here's what she uncovered. Gun legislation is both complex and controversial, and the laws change from state to state. Assault rifles like the one used to shoot former President Donald Trump are banned in nine states, including New Jersey and Delaware. This is just a fact here in Pennsylvania, and in many states, those rifles are legal to buy. They were federally banned for 10 years, and when that ban was allowed to expire, we saw the rate of mass shootings triple. Josh Fleedman is the campaign director for Ceasefire PA, a nonprofit, nonpartisan gun violence prevention organization. The group is calling for the state to close a background check loophole for long guns, including automatic rifles. Currently, Pennsylvania requires background checks for all handgun sales. It also requires background checks for long guns, like assault rifles purchased from a firearm dealer but not those purchased from a private seller. Maybe it's your next door neighbor, maybe it's the stranger in the parking lot outside of a gun show. If you're buying an AR-15 or long gun from them, there's no background check required. AR-style rifles have been the focus of debate the last two decades. It's a weapon commonly used by mass shooters. Just the impact of, an, of a bullet, fire, the very same type of caliber bullet fired from an AR-15 versus a handgun, the impact on the human body is much more catastrophic. The Giffords Law Center tracks the correlation between gun laws and gun violence across the U.S. and gives states a grade on their prevention efforts. The group gives New Jersey an A, Delaware a B plus, and Pennsylvania a B, recommending PA close the background check loophole, pass a red flag law, which prevents a person who might be dangerous or in crisis to have a gun, and enact a safe storage law. Liz Crawford, CBS News, Philadelphia.